U.S. Secretary of State Antony Blinken pledged on Friday to get to the bottom of the mysterious Havana syndrome, which has some allege or which some allege could be caused by Russian microwave attacks. Blinken details new efforts to investigate the illness, which has affected hundreds of U.S. personnel. The State Department on Friday named new officials for its investigation into the cases of Havana syndrome. The development comes after increased pressure from U.S. lawmakers to investigate the cases of brain injuries in diplomats and intelligence officers. During a briefing addressing the issue, Blinken pledged to tackle this strange health incident affecting U.S. officials. He announced the appointment of Margaret Uyehara as senior care coordinator for affected employees and Jonathan Moore as coordinator of the department's response task force. Pretty simple. People have been profoundly, profoundly affected by this. And when you sit down with, with our people and hear um, what's happened to them, how they've been affected, um, it's very, very powerful. And it only reinforces in me the absolute conviction that we need to do everything possible for our people to care for them, to protect them, to get to the bottom of what happened. But you can't help but being personally affected when you hear directly from our folks uh, their stories, how they've been affected, how this has affected their, their lives. We will get to the bottom of this, and meanwhile, we'll do everything we can to care for our people. Officially called anomalous health incidents, or AHI, the syndrome is believed to be caused by microwave radiation first reported in the Cuban capital Havana in 2016 to 2017. The symptoms include vertigo, headaches, hearing loss, nausea, and possible brain damage. U.S. diplomats and intelligence officers residing in other countries including China, Austria, Colombia, and Russia have also reported cases of AHI.